good evening hi and welcome to the session which session is this well this is a free data science and data analytics internship session so here i welcome you to this session this is session by 360 dtmg this is 360 dtmg's contribution to the community of data science and data analytics so let me start this session by congratulating you now you must be thinking congratulating you for what you know upskilling is not easy well people give up well you are chosen to upskill so you are chosen to upskill yourself in the career of data analytics and data science and that's the reason you deserve congratulations well the first question that goes is why do we have this internship this free internship so we have this internship to bridge the gap now you must be thinking which gap we are talking about so you now must have studied data science somewhere maybe online maybe you must have joined some classes or you must have studied it in your college right maybe you are 23rd a second year third year student finally a student and want to actually enhance your skills and we all know we all have read those theory part right those theories and all we have read completely theory part and now we want practical experience now you know there is a vast amount of difference between theory and practical there's a big big gap and to bridge this gap we are here with the free data analytics and data science internship data science internship so trained and didn't get a job we're talking about that yes you can use this internship to make sure that you learn practical knowledge you have that practical knowledge required by working in our project so as we said this is data analytics and crisp ml q free internship basically data science free internship and there will be two phases as a part of this internship there will be two phases now the first question that goes is if we have two phases what are these two phases well the first phase first phase is learning phase where we learn python sql data preliminaries now you must be thinking okay we already have read about this we already have learned python sql and data prelim preliminaries why do we need to do that well you need need to do that because you need to brush your concepts right to make sure that you brush your concepts what are we going to do well we are going to do uh, we are going to post three videos every single day in our lms now how would you get access to lms well all you have to do is to fill the google form that will be shared with you in your community right once you share that google form what well, sorry once you fill that google form and share it with us we'll make sure that you get access to the learning management system we have now you must be thinking what is this learning management system lms basically and how does it look like well let me take you to our lms here this is how our lms looks like now here you will get three or three videos every single day every single day three videos and then there will be an assessment taking on which will take you to the linkedin page it will take you to our linkedin page and here like this there will be subjective questions and you have to answer those subjective questions here by typing them those typing those answers here at linkedin now the question is why do we need to type those answers on linkedin can't we just copy paste from somewhere well 
it's not preferred right you'd go and type those answers and it is subjective answers now the basic question why on linkedin well there are recruiters which are hunting for experience or aspiring data scientists or data scientists or junior data scientists and they want them as their employees right now linkedin is very famous for that so when you write something on linkedin you increase your visibility right you create an impact you increase your visibility to the potential recruiters right now once you write assessment for, for the first phase will be for 20 days and after that there will be a, the project phase now you can come to this page and follow us on linkedin now let's get back to the project we are discussing the second phase we are talking about is project phase where we shall assign an expert data scientist we shall assign an expert data scientist who has rich experience of working on real world projects and they will guide you throughout the project. Now, what will happen here? Well, every single day, you'll have meetings. You'll have daily stand-up meetings for 15 minutes every single day from Monday to Friday to discuss what is done and what must be done for next day and then risk challenges that you have. Now, what will you learn from this project? Well, one thing, you learn is how data science works in real life, right? The practical aspects of data science or data analytics. Also, you learn a very important skill that is time management. In 15 minutes, we'll take all the updates, we'll, exp we'll explain you what you need to do and we'll solve your problems and we'll move further. Every single day for 15 minutes, 15 minutes sharp. Now, what will happen after this? Well, once you complete this project, once you complete this project phase, you will be eligible for a certificate, certificate of completion, the internship project completion certificate from 360 DTMG. And as we have discussed, this is a complete free program. So certificate is also free. And we do not charge anything before, during, or after the internship. And the program will start from tomorrow. That is 27th July 2024. And this type of certificate you'll get. Of course, you'll, you have your name and the project name. Basically, the project that you worked on. Right. The project that you learned so much from will be mentioned here. Now, the basic question is, what else do we have to aid in your project? Well, let me take you to our website first. Here, in our website, if you see, we have mind maps. When you go to mind maps, you can see different, different mind maps here, including Python programming fundamentals, SQL concepts, data science, everything here. For example, you go to loop and you can see with examples, we have all those things available, right? Now, when you see all these things and when you revise all these things, you brush up all these concept, it is very easy to do that project. The project that we are talking about, you'll be learning before that, right? You'll be learning about data preliminaries before that. Now. Along with this, we have some extra stuff for you. Well, you are making sure that you learn and we are making sure that we help you to grow. Now, you can come to our learning resources and see what are the micro learning topics that we have. And you can learn from these topics every single day. Of course, you can see what are the upcoming sessions we have. Right, and here we have core learning resources. 
well you can go to digital learning library like this and you can learn from all the pages we have the book we have it is really really good book all the concepts are covered here in a very very simpler way now this is one thing that we offer also here for you we have ai design studio for machine learning now you will be making project right you will be doing project and you will be making project architecture now project architecture when we say is something that we draw during the project to understand what is the complete flow of project how the complete project flows you can draw this our project architecture using this ml workflow architecture well you can be a beginner and you can use this flow flow chart you can be an intermediate person or person with intermediate knowledge and you can use this flow chart or person with advanced knowledge and you can use this flow chart right this machine learning workflow now think of it you being a fresher in this field and having the knowledge how to make a really good project architecture right from the one end to the another end won't it be re really good think of it what an impression it will have on your recruiter won't that be awesome it will be right exactly also talking about learning resources alone here we have data skill assessment we have resume optimization hub for you we have talent connection portal that's coming soon and of course for conceptual understanding and insightful learning we talked about mind maps we have innovative project showcase and animated insight series well you can just watch and learn there we have stuff available or videos of videos available or gif available here you can see those videos or gif and learn a lot right all the advanced concepts we are talking about are here now we have seen what are the resources that we provide in your learning right to aid your learning now what what else do we provide well if you visit our youtube channel here you can see we have home video shorts etc if you see we have placement success story international research public article publication all these things now yes one thing i wanted to mention that we have international research article publication our students get their research papers published and yes this is the living testimony of the same right now we have various videos if you go to the playlist section you will find find we have python videos we have data science videos we have videos from different different domains be it github mlops deployment all these videos we have we have resume preparation session every thursday right there are various session that we are conducting and everything will aid in your learning and of course we have soft skills video and all here in the playlist section you can just come here visit here and yes you can actually use this knowledge for your growth and yes while you are here please subscribe to our youtube channel now let's come back to what we were discussing let's revise it further so first thing you need to do here when we talk about the project we talk about learning phase and project phase two phases first thing you do is phase 1 that is learning phase you revise data preliminaries sql and python concepts you go to the lms uh, lms that you get learning management system and from there you go to our linkedin page you do a ass assessment of course you go to our linkedin page and after that you actually type question answers to the questions that are mentioned after that after that part is done we will have a project phase that first phase will continue for 20 days after that we have project phase and project phase lasts for 15 days so now what will we do here we shall assign an expert data scientist who has rich experience of working on real world projects and they will guide you throughout the project again there will be 15 minutes stand up for meetings every single day from monday to friday to discuss what is done and what must be done for the next day and any risk or challenges that you have and yes we will be discussing about this phase whenever we reach this phase now 
upon completing the project successfully of course you will be avoid, awarded an internship project completion certificate from 360 degree mg on the right you can see this is how it will look like of course you will have your name and project name also b certificate or this project it is completely free right this means we do not charge anything before during or after the internship right so yes and as we discussed this program will start from tomorrow that is 27 july 2024 so team make sure you are using this platform and you are applying to this free internship and yes you'll learn a lot here you'll be part of great learning here at 360 dhmg so what are you waiting for team please fill that google form and yes when you start welcome to this world of learning and yes enjoy your weekend team take care bye